Yeah. I had another question for you while we're like quasi on culture. I was listening to Brittany Renner on uh, Shannon Sharp's podcast. And I listened to a couple other podcasts where it's more culture based and sports based or news based. And they talk about these famous women and their struggle to dating because they don't necessarily want to date the famous rich guys because of the lifestyles that most of them live. And they say, uh, maybe she should get you a nine to five guy, you know, like a guy who appreciates you, values you. But I don't like what I don't like about this is they go from nine to five guy to like broke guy. I think there is a huge difference between a nine to five guy who makes one who makes anywhere from eighty five to one fifty a year can afford a, a decent life. You know, house in a decent neighborhood. Yeah. Kids in good public school. Can afford date night once a week. Now, can't go on the town every night, but can afford date night once, twice a week. We can go out. We can go do something. And they group these they, they group these guys with, like, broke dudes who are, like, can't pay the valet the car when they go out to eat. Guys, Do you think there's a difference? Well, guys that are careful – even once they do get to said restaurant with valet to where they're monitoring what it is that you're ordering to where that affects exactly what they're going to order too, because they're trying to please you enough, whether that be, okay, she got alcohol. I'll start off with one. If she gets a second one, I'm going to stick to water the rest of the night. Or I'm going to go to, I'm going to go from cocktail to beer. Well, that or, oh, she ordered the um, pan-seared halibut with the uh, ganja sauce or some shit, and it's like a $60 meal with bok choy, and now I can't even get my six-ounce six ounce filet that's 44 so now I'm going to settle for the burger that's 23 Not, not the burger. I think... Well, some places have that. John George Steakhouse, Las Vegas. I mean, they're they're in uh, L.A. and New York, too. But John George, now they do like a $35 burger, but it's off the chain. Like, I'll, I have no shame in ordering a fucking burger. That's fair. And at that type of steakhouse, we're not going to Outback, all right? Like, you know what I mean? We're not going to Outback. I, yeah, Outback, doesn't, Outback doesn't even have fucking um, Valley, right? Like, 